Hello all and welcome to episode 3 of this EU4 Holland Let's Play. Um, so we are still a junior partner under the wonderful Burgundy. We are Holland. We're at war with Aragon and Savoy and a few others. Um, just trying to survive really. Actually, I think I'm just going to go for these guys. Get Geneva out. Although Geneva are a junior partner, I think, right? Well, they've got too much land for that. Are they now independent and just... No, they're still a vassal. Let's go for it. Let's kill them. Yeah, because these guys are on their way back. But we should be faster. Oh, no, they're... Hmm. Are we distracted? Uh, collect the benefits over time. It's always worthwhile if you can. Jump on them. Okay. We got the war goal? No, we've lost the war goal again. I feel like the numbers are dropping to our favour. I don't know how Burgundy have been so successful this time. They've done well. Um, I don't want to lose innovativeness. I will take it, lose prestige, and gain and rest. Oh, tech. Postal defense, tax efficiency. Nice. Take the war goal. That'll be another boost. There we go. And I might actually try and take this. I feel like Aragon might be a military tech level behind. They're not. Oh, that's just curious. I'm in a precarious position here, but I'm going to keep doing it anyway. Hmm. We have... Four... Nine... Seventeen. Yeah, we've got to go. We won. We won. <laughs> Idiots. I don't know how they lost that. Defending in the mountains and they lost. Oof. Oh, advisor slot. Let's have a look. Um, land maintenance. Yeah, you'll save me money. Why not? Charles, are you dead yet? Not quite. He's infertile, right? Oh, he's more likely to underestimate enemy strength. Hmm. Also start one-sided wars. Oh, he's done a bit of both here. He's done pretty well, to be fair. Like, I didn't think he could win this. and it... I wouldn't say I've been uh, a big difference here. He's just done really well. And yeah, we can speed up a bit. They're running past me. Yeah. Alright, we've nearly taken it. We're not far off. I mean, we're in the positives. We've nearly taken it. 7%. It means we had a chance, but it was tiny. Now we've got a 28% chance. 35%. Oh, are we going to get it? Are we going to get it? We got it. Oh, business. Right, take Torino. Is Torino their capital at the moment? I think it's Kimberi, actually. I think they move it to Torino later on. Yeah, it's their capital. Okay, that's a big one. got enough for a good fight here. We can't get to them, so yeah, let's just go here then. Oh. 
Wow, they had a lot more men than I thought. Who's these men? Arrogant's just got 25k just floating about over here. Are they trapped? They are trapped. Ooh, they have a lot of men over here. I'm feeling brave because they're not attacking me. They won't. So they took Brescia. They took Geneva. Ooh. That's a lot of aggressive expansion. Oh. I can see some coalitions forming here. I'm not getting any units out of this. That's upsetting. But we'll make money now. Not much by the looks of it. Yeah. Okay, so military, drop forts. Minimize maintenance. And make money. Right. Again, we're still waiting for Charles to die. Um, there'll probably be a lot of editing during this. I don't know why I'm saying it to you. I'm going to edit that part out where I said there's going to be a lot of editing. I'm trying to remember the key moments, I think. Ooh, a new idea. And this is the tech reduction cost for everything. And I'll get inflation reduction, which is good. Um, so local development costs, local goods produced. Burgundy's opinion improves. Yeah, I'll take that. So we've now got that. Which makes these things cheaper. Yeah, it does. Urgh. Right, that's a game changer for the rest of the game. They've gone to war with no manpower there. They're at military level 6. Am I at level 6? I am. Okay. Come on, Charles, die. Now you're 39, but I want you dead. You can't inherit me at the moment. That's 0%, which is fine. As long as that's the case. Because then I can declare my independence war after he's dead. I just want to see what happens with it. And go in the passive route. Kind of how countries would normally play. Not how they would if a player was in charge. Uh, doing unusual things. Morale of armies. Oh dear. Danzig got big. Are they vassals so? Oh, okay, bark. Gain prestige. Yay! Love prestige. Client power and nobility. Do I have a diet summoned? I think I do. Base manpower in Amsterdam. There we go. So gain manpower, gain loyalty. I can now do this again. And clergy. Oh, it's the that one again. Okay, and the burgers. Um, right, the clergy's one going to be easier. And I'll get this one up and then I'll reclaim some land. I'm going to cancel you because I don't care. And we're going to improve relations. This one shouldn't take too long. We'll get the clergy up to probably 55% by the time that's done. Maybe a little lower. And then we'll seize the land. Use military's workforce. Yeah, I will. It's nice to have that. Extra bit of cash each month. 
It's going alright, actually. That will save me some time. Ooh. Admin. There we go. Definitely take the admin over the ducats. I haven't got loads to invest in. It's just, I suppose, workshops and um, churches at the moment. Which, early game, very important, but... Don't need to rush it. Whereas I do need to rush this just in case, because I need that to stay above 40 for me to get the, um, the loyalty up to above 50, which is what I'm after. So I can then go and claim some land. Got another one. All right. Um, production efficiency, you should pay for yourself somewhat. National Epic, Yearly Prestige. Yeah, I'll do that. It's going down still. Alright. So, we've got that done. I'm going to seize. Burgers are fired. Army maintenance up. Oh, you're getting pissed off at Burgundy, apparently. Oh, for God's sake. What's the claim? I'll just get it back. Go. And you should be good. Oh, there we go. Yeah, you get to defend. That was good. Bizarre. That went well. There we go, and now we drop this back down. Oh, we've got some heretics. Okay, I might increase this, that, and no, what was costing me money? Do ideas. This is a possible advisor. It's not something I'm going to rush for. So I'm going to go to admin tech this time. And it's cheaper, noticeably so. 447 power. Hmm. Yay, Poppy is good. And go mercantilism, diplo rep. Interest. I'm going to go mercantilism. I think it's important for the Dutch to have good mercantilism in the game. Uh, ignore the heresy. Or spend the diplomatic power. Which I'll do. That's fine. So I can't do this again until 1479, so that's another three years. Set of titles. Nobility could not be bought. Yeah, I will do that and then annoy them even more. Oh well. What is done is done. It cannot be undone. Because I have done it. And it is Iron Man mode, therefore it cannot be undone. Who are they fighting? Bohemia? What's this war? Attacker against Hungary in the Bohemian Conquest of Hont. Ooh. Hungary is stronger. Bohemia have just been ultra-aggressive here. Oh, tech. I shall tech. Wow. I've already got the military tech? Oh, well, I'll wait for that one. Let's do that. What's this? Oh, tax and military strength. I'll take that. I can wait on this, I think. Can I? What does it give me? No. So it would give me artillery fire. 
Oh, it unlocks the cannons. But I'm not going to war yet, so there's no point in rushing it. I'd rather just save the points. I don't have to be as careful with them. What are you just doing there? Oh, go to Lubeck. Hmm, made a little difference. Not making much, am I? I wonder why. Yeah, I'm losing my claims because the Burgundians won't do it for me, the rascals. As soon as we're out of the um, Burgundian hold, we are going to go ultra-aggressive for a little while. Has to be done. Right, we can stop this and we'll just make friends for a bit. We go. I believe how cheap you are. We'll get you next year. Do I go for the tech or do I go for the ideas? This just gives me more ideas. Hmm. What to think on? How much is that? 512. So different. Ooh, that prestige would be nice. Mm, yeah. Yeah, I am substantially behind on my Diplotech. I think it's to do with Charles being a zero on that. Yeah, it is. Let's change the focus now. Let's even it out a bit. Ignore demands. Um, yeah, I'm going to ignore the demands. I'm just going to spend as much as I can, just to have a chance. And then I'm going to ignore the demands. Lose their loyalty, but gain prestige. Mm. Yeah, see, it affects personal unions and that sort of thing. So I just want to have it as high as I can for that. Just go from there. Right. That's okay. Don't care about smugglers. Is it hitting me hard? Yeah, it's hitting me by half a ducat a month. It's not it's not minor. So what's going on in the world? Let's zoom out. Muscov is still ticking over. Getting bigger. Novograd's nearly gone. Lithuania and Poland are still in their union. Sweden, I don't think, has gone independent yet. No. Austria isn't the emperor. Just to remind you, Austria is not the emperor. It's the platinum. Austria isn't even in the conversation at the moment. What have they done to deserve this? What's going on? Hmm. Oh. They don't have a von Habsburg on the throne. They've got a von Wittelsberg. That's unusual. Not sure what happened there. Looks like a marriage gone wrong. But you know. <laughs> Alright, so we can save there. We'll just do it. Um, you guys, can we... No, we can't. We'd increase force limit for that. Come on, Charles. How far are you for dying? You're 45 now. Oof. Been in charge a long time. Just die. Nobody likes you. Just go! Right, come on. Tech, what's the score on this? I need 482. And now Hess is the Empire. They're just changing every time somebody dies. Oh. 
Denmark has declared a succession war upon Austria. Succession war of what? The Palatinate. <gasps> so it's who takes over this. So you've got 10,000. You've got 17, 16. You've got a lot more than that. Ooh. Okay, so Denmark wants a Palatinate. Don't blame them. I get it. This is going to be an interesting game. For everybody else. Ooh. I don't know how I got this. Oh, Embrace Renaissance. Okay. Um... I'll go with the aggressive expansion. I don't think how it's going to be much use to me, but we'll see. Just waiting for bloody Charles to die. He still has nowhere, right? No. Four uniforms. Oh, that sucks. mind the reform cost. I think I'll probably go Protestant as uh, Netherlands. Holland. Whatever they are at the moment. Holland at the moment. And we're just going to see how that goes. Pretty low down today. Uh -huh. Denmark appear to be losing. So somebody's getting a PU over the Palatinate either way. Hmm. Interesting. Very, very interesting. Oh, yeah, all right. My steel maps can build dot. Can I do workshop? I can't remember. Mm, nothing too profitable anyway. I mean, not bad. But not something to kind of piss your pants over. Now, navy wise, uh, that's. Mm, I need the force limit modifier. That's what would make a big difference for me. Okay. Oh, come on, Charles, just die. We all talk about it. 2015, I do. I might get that. I have... No chance, really. A truce with Friesland has ended. Good. I shall take their land. Yeah, fine. Donation to the Pope. Or... Lose Papal Influence. How far am I off getting to the next one? A couple months. I mean, I'll see if I can just delay it. Get to 15, I'll invest the 15, and then I'll take the one where they don't like me. If, what, if the other one happens, and the other one happens. There we go. Right. I'll lose it. But we've already got it invested, so that's fine. Bit cheesy there, but did it. Truce with Aragon and Savoy has finished. Tech, do I need to save for that? I think it might be worthwhile actually saving for the ideas. 
Um, yeah, because these are good, but they don't affect the tech cost too much. Institution spread is pretty up, pretty strong, but we'll come back to it. I'd rather get the ideas first and then get the military group because I'm ahead on that. Because I'm small, I think I might focus on quality rather than quantity ideas. And go from there. How many points do I need for um, the tech? 482. So reduced. That's a big difference, that 10%. Having that as a first idea group is a good decision. God. Who now? What for? What are you going for? Kimberly. Okay. Actually, I'll just stay where I am. No, I need Burgundy to do well, just in case that inheritance happens. Um, they're going to need their soldiers down here, aren't they? Somebody else can siege that. Uh, yeah, lose prestige, that's fine. It's not much. I'm trying to get the prestige up there. Tyrannical nobles. Lose base tax or lose loyalty. Lose loyalty. All day, every day. Um, at the moment, fort defense would probably be useful. Um, estates, yeah, let's summon them. Let's take away those negative effects. And if I do that, it just gets me prestige, but I don't want to spend admin. Get Trier's opinion up me, and that gets that up. Or a marketplace in Den Haag, which gets me production. I can get on board with that one. There we go. We start sieging. Right. Only 482 was now, I think. A couple of minutes to go. Maybe we'll finish this war. Ignore demands. I ain't got the influence anyway. So, yeah, prestige. Thank you! Hmm. Yep, another group of ideas. So I'm going to go for a military one. Do I want quality first? Yeah, I think I do. Yeah. Quality. Infantry combat ability. The idea is pretty cheap as well. Because I've got the discount. Oh, that discount's amazing. Spare no expense. Take the power. Tech is behind, so it's probably a good choice. Paying no attention to the war. <laughs> I'm not a very good general, as it goes. Probably good that I've got an overlord for now. Hopefully Charles dies in this war and we can just have his land between us and become rich and filthy. I'm down with rich and I'm down with filthy. Giggity giggity goo. You gave it to East Frisia. Didn't you give it to me? No, I don't care about fasting. I mean, it's interesting, sort of. But it doesn't affect me at the moment. Um, a new idea. Ah, oh, yeah, it's a military one. The early army tradition. Yeah, that looks good. So, army tradition, where's that? Here. So, that's going up by 0 0.92 every year. Which is good. That'll lead to better generals, I think. Don't quote me on that, though. I'm not an expert player. I'm just awesome! 
Come on, get the wall goal. You've taken the mick. Been on 42 so many times now. Um, it was Den Haag we wanted it in, wasn't it? Yeah, there we go. Jesus. This is absurd. The amount of times that this has gone through. Again! Wow. Right, go back on the video. Watch how many times this has ticked over. This is absurd. Again. What? This is crazy. Yeah, I'll go the mercantilism. The bargain. Oh, my days. Oh, my days. Um, I'll take the tradition. We three years on that siege. Three years. Bonkers. That was crazy. Makes absolutely no sense how long that took. Hmm. Let me take a loan. Uh. Not delighted with that. Alright, let's get our manpower back up. Manpower. And numbers. Don't have to consolidate, I just want four ranks. And I might go for a fight. So, I've got eight, you've got one, which brings us to nine. You've got six, fifteen, eighteen. Again, it's twenty-one, but it will be defensive. Oh, in the grasslands, it's not that defensive, is it? Okay. Can we go back up there defensive? Oh, actually, we can just de siege this. And then if they come attack us, they come attack us, but I'm okay with that. They're going for Den Haag? No, they're not. So we're in a little bit of a siege race, and we're going to win. I think Burgundy were expecting us to jump in there. Oh, we did it. Got you. Okay, so that should have our numbers. Yeah, we are significantly in control now. Hmm. If we get there in time, it's very unlikely because that chance of success for them. Now, oh, there we go. I might go and take it back anyway. See where they go. I'm not coming. Oh, they are coming back. Are they coming back? They are coming back. I want you back. I want you back for good. Here we go. We're ahead. Yeah, you can build impressment offices. Excellent. Okay, so we're in a siege race against Aragon. Seems to be doing better. Oh, victory. Yay! We win! Now, controls die, please. So I'm getting nothing from this. So, you gain loyalty or I lose stability and loyalty. I'll lose stability. I'm at three. I'm not giving up tax. I need it. Oh, pardon me. Just burped through my nose. So, how are we looking? Charles? 55. Don't live too long, Charles. Come on! What's this? Oh, high income. Yay! Okay, I think we've got as far as we, <laughs> we can get. I know we're three episodes in and we're still a junior partner. Um... Just still waiting for the inheritance, so hopefully we can get there soon. I will trim these episodes down to get us through them a bit faster. Um, but in the meantime, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you soon. Toodles!